For centuries, Jupiter's great red spot has been an icon of our solar system. A storm so massive that it could engulf our entire planet. But now, something strange is happening. The James Webb Space Telescope has captured new infrared images revealing bizarre fluctuations in the storm's structure. Scientists have observed that the great red spot is wobbling, almost as if it's shaken. Its size has been fluctuating unexpectedly, something expanding and other times shrinking. For years, researchers noted that the storm was gradually decreasing in size. It once stretched over 24,000 miles across, but now it has shrunk to about 10,000 miles. However, the latest data suggests that it's not simply getting smaller, it's behaving unpredictably. The storm appears to be breathing, expanding, and concentrating, and no one knows why. Jupiter's powerful jet streams might be playing a role, pushing and pulling the storm in different directions. The planet's intense internal heat could also be affecting its structure. One of the most shocking discoveries is that the fragments of the storm seem to be breaking off making some scientists question whether the great red spot is slowly disintegrating. Despite this instability, the storm isn't vanishing anytime soon. It continues to rage, with winds reaching 425 miles per hour, faster than even the most powerful hurricanes on Earth. But the changes in the great red spot are a warning. Jupiter's atmosphere is more dynamic than we ever imagined, and there may be forces at play that we still don't understand. One of the most breathtaking images captured by the James Webb Telescope is one of Jupiter's auroras. Brilliant displays of dancing light at the planet's poles. Unlike Earth auroras, which are caused by solar particles interacting with our magnetic field, Jupiter's auroras are partially powered by one of its own moons, Io. Io is the most volcanically active body in the solar system. It constantly ejects volcanic material in space, and this material gets caught in Jupiter's powerful magnetic field, fueling its auroras. The new images also reveal a thin, almost ghostly ring surrounding Jupiter. This ring has been known to exist, but Webb's observations have provided the clearest view yet. Scientists were stunned to find hidden structures within the ring, suggesting that Jupiter's moons are constantly shaping and reshaping it. But the biggest mystery is why this ring appears to be slowly shifting, as if some unseen force is altering its structure. These discoveries challenge our understanding of Jupiter's magnetic environment and its interactions with the space around it. Another unexpected discovery from the James Webb Telescope is a massive white band of clouds stretching over Jupiter's equator. This feature spans over 3,000 miles and moves across the planet at a staggering 320 miles per hour, faster than even the most violent storms on Earth. But what truly shocked scientists was that this region is influenced by a mysterious atmospheric phenomenon known as gravity waves. Gravity waves occur when powerful winds disturb the planet's atmosphere, causing ripples similar to the waves that form in the ocean. On Earth, gravity waves are rare and weak, but on Jupiter, these waves are on a completely different scale shaping the planet's upper atmosphere in ways scientists never anticipated. The discovery of these waves suggests that Jupiter's weather is far more extreme and unpredictable than previously thought. Understanding these atmospheric dynamics could help us uncover fundamental secrets about how giant planets behave, not just in our solar system, but in distant star systems as well. Jupiter is home to 79 moons, but the most fascinating of them is Ganymede, the largest moon in the solar system. New images of Ganymede revealed evidence 
of a catastrophic asteroid impact that occurred 4 billion years ago. Scientists believe that a 93-mile-wide asteroid struck the moon, an impact at least 10 times more powerful than the asteroid that wiped out the dinosaurs on Earth. The impact was so immense that it shifted Ganymede's orbit slightly, altering its path around Jupiter. But that's not the only shocking discovery. The James Webb telescope also found water vapor in Ganymede's thin atmosphere, hinting at the possibility of a hidden surface ocean beneath its icy crust. If confirmed, this could mean that Ganymede holds the ingredients necessary for life. A discovery that would change everything we know about habitability in the solar system. These revelations have made Ganymede a prime target for future missions, as scientists search for clues about the potential for alien life beneath its frozen surface. One of the most unexpected discoveries made by the James Webb Space Telescope on Jupiter is the presence of metallic clouds in its upper atmosphere. These clouds, composed of sodium, iron, and silicon particles, reflect light in a way that had never been observed before. Webb's infrared imaging captured bright, shimmering regions in Jupiter's cloud tops, leading scientists to believe that these metallic compounds are forming at high altitudes. But what's even more bizarre is the detection of ammonia rain falling through Jupiter's atmosphere. Unlike Earth's water cycle, Jupiter's extreme conditions allowed ammonia to condense into liquid droplets, forming an eerie type of rain that descends through its massive storms before evaporating back into the gas layers below. This discovery suggests that Jupiter's atmosphere is constantly recycling chemical compounds in ways that are entirely different from anything seen on Earth. The interaction between these metallic clouds and ammonia rain could explain some of the planet's most extreme weather patterns, particularly the turbulent storms that stretch thousands of miles across its surface. Scientists now suspect that Jupiter's atmosphere is far more chemically active than previously thought, and that these processes might be affecting its behavior of its legendary storms perhaps even fueling the mysterious changes happening in the Great Red Spot. Jupiter's moon Europa has been a subject of fascination for decades, and the latest images from the James Webb Space Telescope have added a new layer of mystery to this enigmatic world. Webb's observations revealed strange streaks across Europa's icy surface, which scientists now believe are soul deposits from a hidden ocean beneath the crust. Europa's surface is a vast sheet of ice, but beneath it, researchers believe there is a liquid ocean that could be over 60 miles deep, held in a constant state of motion by tidal forces from Jupiter's immense gravity. The new data also suggests that Europa is actively venting water vapor in space. These plumes detected by Webb appear to be erupting from cracks in the ice, much like geysers on Earth. This means that the water vapor from Europa's surface ocean is reaching space, providing a potential way for future missions to directly sample its chemical composition without having to drill through miles of ice. This discovery raises one of the most profound questions in planetary science. Could Europa deep ocean harbor early life? Many scientists believe that if there is life elsewhere in the solar system, Europa is one of the best places to find it. The combination of liquid water, internal heat, and complex chemistry could create the perfect conditions for microbial life to exist beneath its frozen surface. These findings make Europa a top priority for future explorations, with NASA's upcoming Europa Clipper mission set to investigate its icy shell, surface ocean, and mysterious plumes in more detail than ever before. The James Webb Space Telescope has opened a new chapter in our understanding of Jupiter, revealing phenomena we never expected to find. From the wobbling great red spot to the shifting ring system, 
from metallic clouds and ammonia rain to gravity waves shaping its storms, Jupiter is proving to be a planet of unrelenting chaos and complexity. But beyond its thick, stormy atmosphere, its moons may hold even greater secrets. Ganymede, shaped by ancient asteroid impact, could be hiding a vast underground ocean. While Europa is actively venting water vapor into space, hinting at potential conditions for extraterrestrial life beneath its frozen crust. These discoveries challenge everything we thought we knew about gas giants and planetary systems. If Jupiter is this dynamic, what might we find around other stars in the galaxy? Could this geometry and climate of Jupiter like exoplanets follow similar patterns? And most importantly, could the icy moons of giant planets be the key to finding life beyond Earth? As Webb continues to observe Jupiter, we can only imagine what other groundbreaking revelations lie ahead. One thing is certain, this is just the beginning.